Hey, Dex here. Welcome to a brand new series where I'm going to show off some games to you that are going to be really cheap and really easy for you to pick up a thousand G. The first game in the series we're going to go for is a game called Bouncy Bullets. Hopefully this isn't the one and only episode in True Dex Idol where I pick up a series, only do one or two episodes and never do it again. I'll try my best not to do it this time. Well, for this game, like I say, it's going to take less than 30 minutes for you to get a thousand G. So I've just put a pop, popped a timer in the bottom right hand corner for you can see when I picked up each achievement. But we can categorise all of the different achievements you can get in this game really easy. You've got level achievements, you've got killing achievements and you've got misc achievements. So the misc achievements, there are two of them. One you get for killing yourself for the first time or just dying which you do by falling it off the level or walking into a razor blade which you get later on. Or you get shot by the enemy. A few different ways that you can die, but you get your first achievement for that. That is the first misc one, should I say. The first achievement that you should actually be picking up is for getting three stars on your first level. You should really pick that up on level one, because it's a nice and easy way you can literally just run around the area, as you saw me do earlier. The second type of achievements that you can get are level-related achievements. You get an achievement for beating level 5, level 10, level 15, level 20 and level 25. And you also get an achievement for beating special level 3 and special level 6. But I'll move on to the special levels later on in the video. Then the final type of achievement you get is for the killing enemies type, which you've pretty much seen all of them so far in the game. You get an achievement for killing a yellow or pink enemy, which you get by shooting it with the same colour. You get an achievement for killing a black enemy, which is actually just about to be featured on the video. The black enemy is killed by bouncing a bullet. It can be either coloured bullet before hitting the black enemy and it exploding. And the final achievement you get for killing enemies, enemies in quotations, is for shooting a grey quotation enemy. Where what they can actually be known as is hostages. If you shoot a hostage, you automatically lose the level and it's really easy to avoid the hostages, but you get an achievement for shooting it for the first time, so it's worth doing. You might wonder what footage you are watching here, and the footage is me getting all of the different achievements. So I've done a video for level 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, I think you've pretty much seen all of the other achievements, if not all of the achievements so far for the other ones, like the dying for the first time and killing each opponent. The only thing I haven't talked about is special levels. Special levels are exactly the same as normal levels, so special level 1 and level 1 is exactly the same. The only difference is that there are enemies this time when you come to do the different levels. But it's still not that easy, they're not different in any way. The only other way that you can die in this game I haven't actually mentioned is those laser beams. But they're pretty easy to get over and you literally just jump over those. Uh, you do have to avoid them, there's no way of kind of disabling them or anything. So talking about the game as, as a whole, the game is currently on the marketplace for 4 .99, Which I think could actually be worth it when it comes to getting a thousand G as quickly as possible. If you are looking to get ahead of a friend in a certain month, then this one's a nice and easy one for you to pick up. The game itself is created by the publisher. I'll get this completely wrong, I'll butcher it, but I'll try and put a picture on the screen if I remember to do it in the editing of Ratilica games. It's, it's the one where it's like a little dog. You'll have seen it at the very start of this video of the game loading up. Now, that publisher is renowned for making games that you can get at 1000G really easy and really quickly. And they honestly, they publish games quite frequently as well. So it may be that I feature another one of them games in the coming weeks when we do a few more of these different episodes. So in the video itself, we are at about level 25. And once we beat level 25, we can move on to the special levels. Uh, actually, I believe this one is... Yeah, this one, the, the one that you should be able to see at the moment is level 25. And it, it looks quite complicated, but honestly, when you're playing it, other than the clunkiness of the controls, which I mentioned earlier, actually beating the level isn't too hard. 
And then we move on to special levels, which literally will only take a couple of minutes for us to do. We can see with us beating level 25 there, and the achievement popping in the bottom right there, we're only 20 minutes into the video. The last six levels don't take very long either. So you saw me there quickly selecting special levels. I've not featured the first three levels. This is just special level three. Um, and again, it's it, it's pretty simple. Just a few more enemies trying to get you. So there's only two enemies on there you've got to beat. Skip to the end of the level and there you go. That's your first night G. The one thing I haven't actually mentioned is how much each achievement's worth as well. Like beating level three levels there is worth 90 G and beating six levels in total as well is also worth 90 G. And just beating five levels in the main world is worth 90 G. There are a lot of 90 G achievements in this game, if I'm honest. So if even if you just look at the stack really quickly, uh, you just want an, an easy 90 G. And or if you're looking, even if you're looking to like maybe go for a continuous like little trail. And there you go. You can see in the time in the bottom right there, when I finished that particular level, we were at 23 minutes. So nice and easy. And that was without me doing it with any guys whatsoever. That was me just playing the game as it came, picking up all the achievements as they went along. So hope this video helps out for me. Leave a comment down below what you think of this series. If there's any games you can recommend to me that you want me to feature on the channel. And leave a like if you enjoyed the video as well. Subscribe if you're new to get the achievement being a Dex legend. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.